from, from an investing swing trading perspective, because I, 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 I don't like, I know there's people out there that was trading stuff like some high movers that were kind of like zero substance companies like CCIV, they're, yeah. they're like a SPAC and they're going to, you know, supposedly buy a chunk of Lucid and Lucid like, and like the day before they announced the, the, the deal or something like that, Lucid goes out and says, yeah, our car's going to be delayed by about, about a year. So they kind of sandbag. Yeah. Yeah, it's like kind of sandbag the people holding it. I'm like, it's times like this where it's like, it's really, well, for me anyway, like I want to trade quality, right? Because right. I bought NVIDIA, you know, expecting an earnings beat that it'll pop. It didn't pop. It sold off like 15% actually. But I'm not worried because you look at the fundamentals. This thing grew revenue 61% year over year. That's like mind blowing, mm -hmm. you know? So like wherever the stock price is, the, you, people should remember, you're still buying a company. You're, you're buying a productive well, hopefully a productive company that will generate revenue and grow revenue, right? So sure, it looks bad now, but next year, six months down the line, the story can be completely different, right? Right. I remember, you you know, you, we were talking about that and you looked at it when it had the earnings after hours because it popped up a little bit and sold right off. And you were going, oh, you know, like, oh, fuck, this sucks. Yeah, what's going on? And I, I just looked at the chart and I said, I said, you know, what probably happened because for anybody who didn't see it, there was this, there was, you know, I don't know, a month or so, maybe longer of just consolidation. And then I had this breakout to the upside where it went up like, you know, 30, 40 bucks or whatever it was. And then within a week or two, it came right back down to where it started. And then I had the earnings where it popped up again. So I just, I, you know, I just told you, I said, I said, don't worry, man. I said, all that is, is all these people have been chasing everything all year. They just saw that breakout and they bought it like crazy. And then it came back down a little while later. So as soon as you got the earnings on that first push, all those guys are just trying to sell off or break even. So it's nothing bad on the company. It's just all, you know, you got to, Look at the way the whole market is right now. There's a lot of people just panicking because they're still buying everything that's moving, right?